Hello and welcome to this tutorial on how to build a temperature control system using an ESP8266 microcontroller, DS18V20 temperature sensor, and an OLED display. We will also use the ESP Dash library with async web server library to set up a web server that allows the temperature control system to be controlled and monitored remotely through a web interface. This tutorial will guide you through the steps of setting up the hardware, installing the necessary libraries, and writing the code to implement the temperature control system. By the end of this tutorial, you will have a working temperature control system that you can customize to meet your specific needs. First, let's gather the materials that we will need for this project. ESP8266 microcontroller DS18V20 temperature sensors OLED display 2-channel relay module Jumper wires and 0 PCB or breadboard Now that we have all of the materials that we need, let's start by setting up the hardware. First, connect the OLED display to the ESP8266 using I2C, SCL and STA pins. The OLED display is powered using the 3.3 volt supply from the ESP8266 module and its ground is connected to the ground of the ESP8266. Next, connect the DS18V20 Dallas temperature sensor to the ESP8266 D7 pin. BDD and GND pins are connected to the 3.3V supply and the ground of the ESP8266 module. Then, connect the heating and cooling relays to the ESP8266 D5 and D6 pins. While VCC is connected to the VIN pin and GND to the ground pin of the ESP8266 module. To avoid messy wiring and give a clean look to the project, you can also order a custom PCB from PCBWay.com. We have already designed a custom PCB for this project, and you can download and upload the cover file to their website. Now we have set up our hardware. Let's move on the programming part. This is the final program or source code for temperature control with ESP8266 and Async Wave Server. You can find this program code, require library, and circuit diagram on our website iotprojectsideas.com. I will attach the link in the description. To compile and upload this code to your ESP8266 board using Arduino IDE, first you need to install these required libraries. You can customize your soft AP from here, set your own SSID and password for wireless network. You can set authentication for web dashboard from here. In this demonstration, I am using Edwin as username and 1234 as password. You can set your own. You can find the complete explanation of this program code in your website link provided in the description. Uploading code and distinct project. After necessary customization, it's time to upload code to this ESP8266 node MCU development board. Finally, hit that upload button. It takes a few seconds to compile and upload the code. And that's it. You now have a working temperature control system that you can access and control remotely through a web interface. Here, you can see demo of this project.
Thank you for watching this tutorial on how to build a temperature control system using an ESP8266 microcontroller, DS18B20 temperature sensor and an OLED display. I hope that you found this tutorial helpful that you were able to successfully build your own temperature control system. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comment section below.